Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Autonotom. And before we start, um, I've got this. It's all, you know, very slow. But um, yeah, I thought I'd put it in just to see what it's like. It is extremely slow, but it's fun. Um, also, one of my subs, I can't remember who, I'm really sorry. I should have written your name down and I didn't. But um, oh, we've got stuff to pick up over there. Hold on. Um, they suggested. See how full are we? Oh, we're all at thing. All right, let's turn this off. They suggested putted fans to um to blow me across, which would have been cool. Uh, let's see. Let's put the concrete in there and cobblestone stairs. We still need stuff. Okay, did I put a a chest over here? What a hat. Do I have any oh I have an iron chest. That could work. Okay, let's put this here and put our potatoes in it. But um but yeah, they suggested putting in some fans. Blow me across. Which could work as well. That is an idea. But the conveyor belts, I already had them on me and I thought I might as well just put them down. And, you know, I don't want those, thank you. Um, yes, I forgot to check those before. Is this empty? No, it's not. That, did that go up or down? I don't. Oh! Press the wrong button. Uh, 6760. Oh, you're taking forever. Are there any ways to make this faster? There probably is. I don't know what it is. Just here watching the thing climb in the background. And then I'll know if it's going in or out. No, it's going up. Okay. I keep forgetting I need to... Alright, that has nothing in there, so that is going through. The plant oil, that is... Thing. But anyway, back to our conveyor belt. Um, so yeah, it's slow, but it's fun. Um, it's definitely the scenic route. And for whatever reason, when I get to the drop off here, I couldn't put the um the the, the conveyor belt on a diagonal. I have no idea why. It went in, and then I had to move it, and then I couldn't get it back in. So there's that. You know, it's a thing. Um, right, so today, what I wanted... No, I don't need that. What I wanted to do was ingot tripling. So we want the electric pump, the electrolytic separator, and the purification chamber. And, um, okay. So let's see what we need electric it would help if I could actually you know what would help if I shifted my keyboard over a little bit I pushed it over and that's why my key my fingers are on the wrong keys okay can we make any of this we need steel casing oh man steel sheet metal okay steel casing steel sheet metal can we do that nope Okay. Steel. Uh, craft. We let's see if we can make sixty. Missing an engineer's hammer. Okay. Cancel. Engineers. Oh, it's got an apostrophe. I'm guessing. Hammer. Well, it should correct English and all of that. There you go. Engineer's hammer. So now we need sheet metal. No. Steel. Eight. Craft. Sixteen. There you go. Start. Okay. That seems to be done. And now we want the electric pump. Uh, we need the steel casing, so we want that. Nope. 
So we want that, that, we want to make four of those in your pop. Nope. Steel casing. Got one of those. And then the electric pump. Awesome. Right, so that's done. The electro electrolytic separator. Uh, electro electrolytic. Okay, we need to make an ele electrolytic core, which is that. And there's the separator. That was pretty easy. And the purification chamber. Right. Purification. There you go. Oh, these. Advanced control circuits. We don't have any of those. What else are we missing? Enrichment chamber. Didn't we make one of those? But we need another steel casing. And I think we need more sheet metal. Okay. Um, right. Make two more of those. What are we missing? Nope, not osmium. Instrument chamber, steel casing. Steel casing? Thank you. Oh, glass. Do we not have any more glass? We have no glass. Really? Alright, um, furnace. Alright, let's sand. Sandstone. Let's take a stack of sand. Put it in the furnace. And that should cook up pretty quickly. Because that will go straight into our system. Okay. All right, so steel casing. That and that, so that's done. Um, purification chamber. That needs the enrichment chamber. What are we missing? Oh, we need another basic control unit which is redstone and osmium okay give me a second let me go and make some more of those okay right i'm back uh we need another basic control unit i went and made a whole set of those and a whole set of enrichment alloy because they're the basis of anything so there's that no, let's put that in there and what did we what's it called purification chamber purification okay so we need these red ones which i haven't made yet okay um okay Can we make a stack of those I know I have enough to make a stack. Drop those in, right? Right, purification chamber. Where's the enrichment chamber? That's there, because did I not make that? Yes, but it didn't want to pull it in. Okay, purification chamber. That's cool. Are we going to get a ding? We have a ding. And we want to pick a loot chest, we'll pick the middle because we can. And so now that we have some basic mechanism infrastructure, we can look at increasing the yield of our ore processing. In order to get three ingots per ore, we need to add oxygen into a purification chamber with our ore, which will produce three ore clumps per ore. These, these clumps are then processed in a crusher to produce three dirty dusts, which are processed in an enrichment chamber to produce three dust which can be smelted into ingots. To get oxygen for our purification chamber, we'll need an electrolytic separator, which will take water and split it into hydrogen and oxygen. 
Okay, but then there's no word on how to... How do you set this up? Do you put them one next to each other? Do you... Okay, there's only one way to find out. Okay. There is only one way to find out. Come over here. I'm going to take this back up though. Fun as it was, it's extremely slow and it just gets in the way. So I will have to just keep bouncing. <laughs> What's this? Ba gas burning generator. Oh yeah, we did. Did. Um, we did do this last time, didn't we? We have wind power. That's a basic energy cube. Yeah. Yeah, so we should really make a huge energy cube. Wow, that lighting on there, I had to look at it because it just looked weird. I'm getting distracted by shinies. But yeah, we need to make a bigger energy cube so then um, we've got more stuff coming in. And didn't it... Um, it lit up for all the energy cubes even though we hadn't done them. Advanced is... 2.2 MRF and what was the other one? Elite. Okay. All right, let's open this. Uh, blue diamond shulker box and a white di diamond shulker boxes. Okay. I have never seen a blue diamond or white diamond shulker box. Never heard of them, I should say. Diamond. Where's that from? Oh, iron chest. Okay. You need diamonds. How do you get heart diamonds? I keep seeing them and I don't know. I want one. I want to find one. Uh, you need a light blue iron shulker box. Um, how do you... Oh, a normal shulker box. Okay. 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 But, um, oh wow, look at the space in that. So we get two, two of these diamond shulker boxes, which has those, oh, look at that. I'm, I'm impressed. Okay, right. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, I keep getting distracted by the shinies. Right, let's take this from here, because we don't need this right now. Um. Okay, how did they put it in the... I don't... Do you put them all down one next to each other? Do they... Uh, electrolytic separator. What was the other thing? Oh, an electric pump. I... I don't even know if Mechanism has a manual. And okay, let's have a quick. Oh, balloons! Oh, what do you do with the balloons? Gray balloon. Oh, get the balloon, feather, string, and some kind of color. But what do they do? Do they are they just decorative? I don't know. Right, shinies. Do not get distracted by the shinies. All right, I'm not seeing any kind of manual. Oh, I forgot they have the atomic disassembler. I've seen that. Um, you kind of like just point it at ores and you can, it's like a, it's like an advanced pick. How do you make that? Uh, atomic alloy. Okay. Um, okay, so we need another machine for that. All right, but there's no, there's no, um, there's no, um, manual or anything. All right, well then this electric pump. Uh, oh, electrolytic separator. 
no recipe. Okay, so you can put brine, water, heavy water, and that splits off into hydrogen and oxygen, which is what they were saying. Oh, so you can either put brine, gives you sodium and chlorine, or heavy water, which gives you deuterium and oxygen. Okay, there's the electric pump. So it's another kind of generator, maybe? I think this is like a, a generator to give you power. I'm guessing. Because these square these square bits, that's where the power is that where the power goes in? Let's go how oh it's night time. I think those square bits are input and output. Yeah. You've got green and you've got orange. And you've got input and output on that side. Okay, well that would make sense because you need some way of inputting and putting your stuff into storage. And the purification chamber, no recipe. Okay, so nether tin ore and oxygen gives you flint and tin clumps, three tin clumps. Tin shard. Does the flint power it? I don't understand. I don't get it. Because you've got flint, you've got a basic gas tank. So you need some kind of tank. Obviously, yeah, because if you've got the electrolytic separator, it's gonna need to put the outputs into some kind of tank. Okay, we're I'm gonna I'm gonna puzzle this out. Gonna puzzle this out. Alright, there was a quest for tanks. Basic gas tank, advanced gas tank, elite gas tank, and elise elite gas tank. It's not a girl, so it's not elise. Elite gas tank and ultimate gas tank. As you start making various gases, it might be useful to store some for later or have a buffer. These tanks can store up to 100, 512 buckets of gas. Okay. Alright, so if we make two gas tanks... Oh, but they've had a something for, for fluids as well. This is... Uh, no, those are bins. Oh, so super fluid storage. Okay, we did one. Oh, I made one ages ago. Okay, let's make fluid tanks. Make a fluid tank and a gas tank. And for whatever reason, it tends to, um, to, what you call it? To, to, oh, I can't think of the word. It completes, it auto-completes when, oh, it's, it's a lot faster if you walk, a bit like a travelator. You know when you go into Ikea or, one, or at the airport and you got the travelator? I might leave this in then, because that was a lot faster. Sorry, <laughs> I keep getting distracted by the shinies. Okay, um, right, fluid tank. I've got tons. Basic fluid tank. Um, ultimate, elite. Advanced. Can I make one of those? There you go. Advanced fluid tank. And then we want a... A gas tank? Oh, because I put in fluid. If I put in tank, I would have seen it. Right, basic gas tank. Oh, is that it? And then, um, and it's gone back to fluid. Why? I noticed that when I was making stuff, I was looking for something and I'd type in something and it would go back to whatever the previous thing was. I don't know why. All right, um, tank. Um, advanced gas tank. 
Okay. So that should get both of them actually. So back. Yeah, that's got the gas tanks, which is fine. And this is what bin it. Well, let's make a basic bin and just get that out of the way as well. Basic bin. Trying to make. Oh, okay. There you go. We've got one of those as well. Get that out of the way. I don't know if we would ever need to store um, 4K worth of a single item, but it's good to know that it's there. Um, back. Actually, no, you wouldn't even, because I was thinking, oh, we'd need it for the, the fertilizer thing. But um, actually, we wouldn't, because now we've got the, the wind wind power. So we don't need that. All right, let's open these. Legendary rewards, HDPE pellet, and HDPE sheet. What is that for again? I should know. It sounds familiar. HDPE. That's from what mechanism? What? A pressurized reaction chamber. I'm guessing with oxygen and liquid ethylene and a substrate will give you an HD, HDPE pellet and oxygen. Okay. Makes no sense to me, but it's legendary. Right, let's put these away. Back in, put that in, put in our, at least one of the shulker boxes. Right, there's our tanks. Oh, cables. Cable. We've got advanced universal cable. Do you use that for everything? Universal cable capacity. Hold on. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay. Um. I think that's. So is it that you can use this for fluids as well as as well as electricity? No, it's not what I wanted to do. Okay. Well there's only one way to find out. Alright, what are these? That's advanced universal oh ultimate universal cable. Alright, but anyway. Okay, let's have a look. Right, so this is the electrolytic separator. I wonder if you put the pump... I wonder if you put the pump on the front. Judging by input-output slots, only one on the front. Okay. Something just gave me. Something gave me a different thing. I don't know. All right, so I'm guessing. All right, there's no fluid. We need electricity. Got the electric pump. Um, if I take this away, got input and output there. All right, let's move this. Let's move this over a little bit. Um, electrolytic separator. Put that there. Input and output on both sides. Basic universal cable. Can I attach advanced basic? One way to find out if we can mix and match. Oh, we can. And that goes straight into here. Right, that's getting RF. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. All right, we are going to, I'm going to puzzle this out. We're going to do it. Now that's the gas tank. We want the pump. There's our electric pump. 
put that on the front. Oh, for a second, it gave us a different, a different thing. Okay, right, if we put gas tank on one side, is that connected? No, it's not. Right, so we need cable for that too. Um, purification chamber. Sort that in a second. Gas tank. Nope. Right, that's not going to work. But is this only for energy? That might only be for energy. That might not be for anything else. Okay. Um, other tank. Fluid tank. We should have had two fluid tanks. One for the pump. Right. Step back. Input, output. Both. Fill. Empty. Okay. That's not working. Alright. That would work if we put this on top here and do I have a bucket on me I have three all right let's go get some water and then let's see what this does That's in there, it's not moving. No fluid. Disable. Right, we want it to disa be disabled. That's empty. Why is it empty? Oh, because it needs power. Okay. Um... No, we don't need it going into there or there. Okay, that's not going to... Hmm. Didn't think about that one. All right, we need power. Okay. Main for these, but not for that. There's input and output, and I'm guessing to disable it. All right, how are we gonna get power? All right, let's go around this side then. It's nice to know that you can mix and match. No, that's not go. Yeah, it's not going into that. Let's see how long it is before I I call defeat and go and have a look on the internet. Okay, that goes there. That's a bit hokey, but that, but that's not going in. Upgrade. No. Right. Can I get a bucket of water? Where did I put the? Here's the tank. Put that down. Where's my bucket? Take out the bucket. Alright, I don't know. Do I have to? Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Alright, this is where I... I decide I'm going to go and find out because I don't know that right, has power I put water in there no I put it there yes what's it doing it up but I don't know what it's doing Oh, it's separating. What is it doing? Where is it going? It's not going into the electric pump. But from that bucket of water, it's separating it out into hydrogen and oxygen. Okay, Um, the tank. Where's the tank? Where is the tank? I got the tank, yes. Uh, fluid tank. 
hydrogen, oxygen. Those are both gas tanks. Oh, okay. So maybe I don't need to fill up. I don't know what's going on with the pump though. Pump needs. Okay. Right, so we need the gas tanks to take the gases out of here. Um, purification chamber? I just stick you on here somewhere. Definitely directional facing. That has power. Uh, recipe. Oxygen. Do I have any tin? And this is all iron. Gravel and oxygen gives me flint. Okay. Um, what's in this? Hydrogen. Alright, what can I use hydrogen for? Recipe. Uh, gas tank oxygen. Alright. Hydrogen. Liquid hydrogen. Um, is it not going to show me the recipes I can use it in? Alright. We need to get out the oxygen. Yeah, using this as a travelator, it's just as fast as walking across. Um, gas tank. Right, we just want a basic one. And we need a basic fluid tank. Which I know I have. Do we have one that's empty? That's got water in it. That one's empty. This one has water. Okay. Um, oxygen. All right, water. No, here. That's it. So that will keep going. Um, hydrogen. Where's the hydrogen tank? tank. That was empty. This one has hydrogen. Right, and the other gas tank with oxygen. Right. So we have our two tanks. Let me see if I have any tin ore. Uh, or no do i have any or at all um i have bauxite bauxite um i have osmium any other kinds of ores no i do not because i am ultra efficient and usually i just throw them into the pulvis Okay, has this finished doing what it's doing? It's still processing. Okay. Right, so then... Um, have a look at the recipes while we're waiting then. Uh, so that's tin. Gold. Why does it say flint in there? Can you use flint instead? That's gravel. I should have checked to see if we could use flint instead. It'll probably take a lot more. Osmium. Flint will give you three. Let's go and get some flint. Now, I know this episode will end up running a bit over. But like I said, I want to puzzle this out. And then I will go and 
After I finish, I will go and have a look online and see um and see just how far off or how close we were. Oh, that's the only thing about the conveyor system. If you get caught on it, then you end up going backwards. And I don't really want to go backwards. So I think I'm going to pick it up anyway. Because it was fun, but it's not what we wanted to do. Alright, so osmium and tin. Oh, I need to put in a lot of tin. Okay, oh, so the tin would produce oxygen and that would give us three osmium clumps. So bauxite. No, box, bauxite didn't like that. Okay, that's fine. Three osmium clumps and then it said that it does what now? Uh, back. Alright, the clumps are then processed in a crusher to produce three dirty dusts and then you put it in the enrichment chamber. Okay. Uh, crusher, basic crushing factory. Oh yes, we were making this stuff, weren't we? Which we don't need anymore. Alright, crusher. To give us dirty ones. Although that is. And then the enrichment chamber, which I don't think we've put down yet, have we? Nope. Um, enrichment chamber. No, gas burning generator. Did we put down the enrichment chamber? I know. This one. Enrich enriching back. No, is the enrichment chamber something different? Enrichment. Oh, we, we... I don't think we made one of those. Okay, let's go make an enrichment chamber. We made one as part of... um. We made one as part of... Uh, whatever it was just now. Yeah, walking on this is definitely a lot faster. Right. Um, enrichment. Oh, we need to go back this whole little thing. Thank you. And that. Thank you. I think I might just take out the um the corner and just build the base as one big old square. I don't know. I really have to think about what I want to do. I don't know what I want to do with it. Right, the enrichment chamber. This is so obzocky looking. Alright, does that finish? That's finished. Okay. Right, the enrichment chamber. And then that will give us something that we can process. Okay, osmine dust. Alright. Okay. So why we have an electric pump, I don't know. I'm guessing it's probably a way of powering it because we seem to have gotten every everything I don't know basic fluid tank empty can we pull fluids all right let's do a quick thing and then I will finish because we've, we've puzzled it out, got it to work. So I'm not, I'm actually quite pleased with myself because they didn't give us any documentation, but we, we did it, which is good. But I just want to see this last thing and then I'm going to sign off.
because like I said, it's probably end up going to be a little bit longer than usual, but that's fine. I don't know. I'm not quite sure what to do, but okay. Unless we've got to put it on this side, maybe. Off. Off. Pump. That was still going. I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, we have. All right. We have the water tank. It's working. That's hydrogen. This one. And oxygen, which is that one. Okay. So we've got. We do have all. Or doubling, or or doubling, or tripling. It's. I can't even say it's within our grasp. We can do it. I'd stop digging up my base, while I do it. But we have it. We've got all tripling if we wanted it to. It's a bit of a faff, but you know, if we were desperate and we really need it, then yeah, that's fine. That means I could probably get rid of the pulvis. I don't know how you'd automate this. I really don't know. I don't know how you'd automate it. So that's what I'd need to go and find out. Because you should be able to go from one to the other unless they depend on some other kind of cable. So these universal cables are not universal as in they can they can take either fluids or electricity. They will only take RF. Uh, purification chamber, enrichment chamber. And that is crusher. Okay. But we've we've done it. We've got all tripling, which is pretty good. So thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel and I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.